I'm going to do a short tutorial about how to load your own animations into your Thunkable X app. So for this we're going to use Piskel app, that's P-I-S-K-E-L-A-P-P -P dot com, Piskel app dot com. And I already have an account here, I'm logged in to create sprite. So if you're not logged in yet, log in and then click on create sprite. When I want to animate it, I'm going to duplicate the frame. I might use the hand tool to move it up a little bit. You can preview it over here and you can speed it up or slow it down um, with this one right here. All right, when I'm happy with it, I'm going to preview um, to see what my animation looks like. It looks like a kiwi bird shooting laser beams, which is what I want. Um, when I'm all done with my animation and I'm happy that with how it looks, I am going to click on this picture over here. This is export. And I'm going to download my sprite as a GIF and that will save right on my computer. So now I'm going to go back to Thunkable. I'm going to create a new project and I'll call it animation. Alright, this is going to be pretty simple. I'm going to add a, another screen. On the first screen I'm going to put um, two rows In the top row, I'm going to put a image. And in the bottom row, I'm going to push a button. And so for this image, you can just upload that GIF that we just saved. And then, as you can see, um, the animation has been added to Thunkable. So you can add your own animations in your applications or your games. Uh, thanks a lot for watching.